Okay, so let's get round to modifying the Bugs B3 hit. Now it's quite simple, you just take the four screws off the top of the canopy, take the canopy off and you are left with this. Unplug the lead light from here, the two screws usually in there, unscrew them and just pull the lead light out and take put it to the side. Now where you've taken the lead light from right here gives you the exact voltage that is coming from your main battery. So you could therefore put plug in a VTX or anything else. Anything else, remember it's a two cell battery that's running so your max voltage at the start will be 8.40 and it will keep dropping as the battery is dropping itself. Bear that in mind. Now to install the camera it was really really simple. I just put a whole load of double foam tape on, stuck it right there and put the canopy back on like so. And because it was quite snug, it was holding the antenna down just enough to hold the camera nice and snug with that double-sided foam tape on and it did not move whatsoever. The, the way I hooked it up was I've made myself a little connector here and this is quite a cool connector so I, I can plug that into the main power little socket here like so. And I can plug it into any AIO 3-in-1 camera. This is a 200, uh, it's switchable up to 200 milliwatts from 25 milliwatts. And I can use that cable for any other one. Just make sure the camera that you plug in, uh, it can take five volt input because where you want to plug it into is right here on the board. And the right pin is five volt, the middle pin is your negative and your left pin is for FPV. All I did was plug that in there, like so. I stuck the camera in there like so. And that was me, and off I flew. Now, I tell you one thing. I thought that flying in this so-called acro mode that comes with this quadcopter is really hard. But it's not, it's like flying in stability mode in any other quadcopter. It, it actually flew a lot better than what it does in its altitude hold mode, i.e. with the barometer on. I didn't like it at all. It, it just wasn't, it wasn't steady enough. And it had nothing to do with the camera. It was even like that on my review. So if you're going to fly it, take it out and put it in acro mode. Just remember you need to unplug the battery, turn the transmitter off, put it in acro mode and plug everything back in and turn it all back on and that's you set. It flew absolutely amazing. It wasn't like if I moved the stick, it would totally flip over. It wasn't doing that and I didn't do any flip because what I did was I just flew it out at the back area because I was too busy and I couldn't get the fuel. Plus, I'm going to be um, plugging in a VTX here, kindly sent enough out to me from AKK, because this little socket, like I said, gives you the exact voltage from your two cell battery. And I'll be plugging a run cam in here as well. Um, that's basically it. Enjoy the little flight footage. I'll put up when it's flying in altitude hold mode and then you can see the difference when I switch into that so-called acro mode and believe it or not don't be scared of it because it's just like flying in stability mode. That's basically all I've got to say about the quadcopter itself. It's so easy to take apart. All I need to do now is just put that light back in there like so and put the two screws back in Put the canopy back on, like so, and put the four screws back in, and you would have never known that I would have put an FPV camera on it. So enjoy the little flight, and I hope you like this uh, little how to put your little FPV camera on it, because it's straightforward, really simple. It took me five minutes, if anything. You just need to make that little... Um, 
this little cable that I made and it's just your normal standard three pin plug for you, or any FPV camera that I snipped off and hooked it onto there, that's it. Thanks for watching this video, don't forget to check the links in the description below where you can get not only the quadcopter but the camera as well and there will be discount codes there. I hope you enjoy the flight and happy flying.